Hey everyone, so today I will be sharing with you my Trader Joe's hauls. As you can see from the title, my boyfriend and I went to Trader Joe's yesterday because we don't have Trader Joe's in Canada. So we had to cross the border and, you know, do our own thing. But yeah, let's get started. First thing is this packaged kale. Yes, it is packaged. I know Trader Joe's, you need to step up. You need to change your packaging, but whatever. Um, I don't normally buy vegetables from Trader Joe's just because of the conversion from US dollars to Canadian. But yesterday, I decided to pick this up because why not? I'm already there and my fridge doesn't have any vegetables at all. So I had to pick up even just one item next thing i picked up is this soy slices this is the cheddar flavor i don't think i saw other flavors but yeah i got this because it was only 2.99 us dollars um if you compare it to other vegan cheeses it is pretty reasonably priced so i picked it up i just hope that it tastes good Next up, this sprouted tofu. I got two things of sprouted tofu. This is the extra firm. I believe they don't have firm or medium firm, just the extra firm. So I got two of these and I've had it before and it was okay. So I'm gonna make some tofu spam. Ezekiel bread, I had to get this. This was only $3.49 at Trader Joe's. Again, if you convert it, it's pretty much the same thing. It's going to be like for something Canadian dollars. But I love Ezekiel bread. And even if I wasn't in Trader Joe's, I'm going to be getting this anyway. So yeah, not all the time because it's pretty expensive. But if I'm eating it, I feel good. I mean, I don't feel guilty at all because I don't know. It's just... It's healthy. It's a healthy bread. So if you haven't tried it, please try it because it is really worth it. Let's move on to a pantry staple of mine. This is the maple syrup. I know I'm from Canada. I should get my maple syrup here in Canada. But again, since I'm already at Trader Joe's, might as well. And I've already tried this before. I like it. So why not? Next up is the Trader Joe's Organic Tahini. Again, Trader Joe's prices are pretty reasonable. So I got this for only $3.49, I believe. And if you buy it from here, it's going to be a ton of money. So this is good for my peanut sauces or like dressings or whatnot. But usually, I use it for my tofu with bell pepper and then just make like a peanut sauce out of it. It's really good. Next up, flour. I had to get myself this 5 pound 100% white whole wheat flour. I didn't notice that it was white. I, pr I prefer the brown kind but the thing is I've had all-purpose flour before that's just a regular flour and I'm okay but yeah I thought it's gonna be like the brown one but whatever I got two things of the roasted seaweed snack this was 99 cents so it's pretty good and I believe this is organic is this organic it doesn't say it's organic, but I'm pretty sure it's organic. But yeah, I got two things of this. I can't, I don't, I don't know where the other one went, so. I got two things of the Italian tomato paste. This is in the tube kind, or tube form, if you will. I really like using this instead of the canned ones because I don't want to use a tablespoon of the canned tomato paste and then use it again or just transfer it into a jar maybe maybe I'll use maybe I'll do it maybe I'll do that next time but I just find this really handy it's very easy to use just squeeze whatever you need and you're done it's only $1.99 I don't remember but 
it's pretty good for the price so i got two i got my favorite chocolate this is the dark chocolate lovers chocolate bar and this is the 85 percent cacao and it's so good if you haven't tried this it's really good and the packaging is so good this comes with two inside so there's one and two it's really good it's really good you have to try it another chocolate i got the semi-sweet chocolate chips and i believe this is a vegan I believe this is vegan but um yeah i got this you know just for snacking or if you want to make pancakes with chocolate chips you can if you want to make chocolate chip cookie you can use this as well it's very versatile and yeah i got myself some peppermint tea this comes with 20 tea bags and sometimes i like green tea sometimes i like peppermint tea i like all kinds of tea so yeah oh and i didn't notice that this is no caffeine i guess that's a good thing because i've been i've been having caffeine withdrawals like if i don't drink coffee my head hurts for some reason but i i think i should just like cut down my um, caffeine intake i saw this miso instant ramen soup and i checked the ingredients it seems like it is vegan i got the raw cashew pieces this is expensive nuts are expensive so what's new about that but i'm gonna make some sort of cheeses out of these so it's gonna be pretty handy and i'm gonna make like pasta sauces out of this as well so yeah again it's a staple so it's gonna last me for quite some time i also got this scallop cracker trio because i watched this girl on youtube she's a um trader joe's employee and she said to buy this whenever you see this i think it's a limited edition i checked the ingredients and it seems like it is vegan i got myself organic flaxseed meal this was pretty reasonably priced again i had my old flaxseed meal for quite some time now so i had to get rid of that um, this is good for like making your flaxseed eggs and you know just for baking or if you're making smoothie you should add this if you're vegan you have to take this whenever you can maybe i should try to make this no bake energy bites Ooh, maybe i should so i don't have to do anything except like mix all the ingredients that sounds lovely next thing i got is this package sun-dried tomatoes this is good for pasta and sauces things like that this is actually my first time buying sun-dried tomatoes i mean i've had it before but you know I, this is the first time that i actually bought it for myself for my pantry so i'm really excited this will give lots of flavors to your dishes that's for sure i got myself some japanese style panko bread crumbs i like making my own cauliflower wings so this is pretty handy and it was only like $1.99 from trader joe's i got this organic pasta vegetable I don't know how you say that but i've had this before it was okay it was good pasta is pasta i mean they don't really taste anything if you don't put any sauce on it or to it so i had to buy my green jackfruit so i bought two because they're not that cheap but you know i love this so much i make the um, vegan 
pulled pork out of this so this is staple in my pantry i love it so much it's so easy to make i got two things of chickpeas this is not the organic kind but that's okay maybe i'll transition to organic next time but for now i'm eating healthy i feel healthy and that's all that matters i got two cans of white kidney beans cannellini beans or whatever i got two things again this is not organic uh, i don't really buy white kidney beans but i want to make my own vegan sausages and they the recipes that i see online they always use white kidney beans so i'm gonna make that and i'm also gonna make like dips or like you know bean dips using the white kidney beans so yeah of course i had to get my black beans that's a staple again and i had to get my diced and fire roasted canned tomatoes i got two of these this is so good in pasta just use this add your seasoning and that's it really good really really good i had to try this organic pumpkin so i got one can you know just to try because i'm not really a pumpkin person if you will but yeah let's i'm gonna try it i also got a can of coconut milk this is the last thing in this haul um i really like this full fat i accidentally got the reduced fat before but i uh, personally like the full fat because why not i mean just go for the real thing right but that's it for this haul i actually bought two more things i got the spud spud crunchies i'm gonna insert a picture and the vegetable sticks whatever but they're all done <laughs> so yeah that's all that i got from trader joe's i hope you enjoyed this video I personally like Trader Joe's. I know a lot of people like Trader Joe's. And yeah, I wish we have it in Canada, but we don't. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video again. And if you like it, please give this a thumbs up. And we'll see you on my next one.